Hello, my name is Ben Sayer. In this video, I'm going to show you the improved PDF support in Family Tree Maker 2014. Here I've got a tree that I've converted from a Family Tree Maker 2012 tree. And it's got just a couple pieces of media in it. I'm going to click over to the media workspace. And you can see there are a couple of Adobe Acrobat PDF files here. If I open one of these, you can see that the contents of it now display in Family Tree Maker 2014 where they didn't previously. You may also notice that the thumbnail has this Adobe Acrobat logo and uh, one of the new features in 2014 with respect to PDFs is that you can uh, refresh these thumbnails for existing PDF files, any files that you have already, uh, media files you already have loaded into your Family Tree Maker file. If they're showing this logo, you can update them so that they actually show the first page of the PDF document. You do that by right-clicking either here or you can do it uh, over here in the right pane, it doesn't matter, and selecting Refresh Thumbnail. And you can see that little picture updates to show you what that first page of the document looks like. Now that thumbnail will automatically look like the first page for a new PDF file that you add. So for instance, if we add one, either by clicking up here or pressing Control M on the keyboard, we're going to add new media, and I'm just going to pick a PDF file here. I'm going to tell it to link to it, and I'm going to tell it it's a document, and click OK. And you can see that PDF file thumbnail looks like the first page of the document, and indeed we can open that PDF and switch from page to page.